One of the dumbest rules in game show history is on Jeopardy, where you have to give your response in the form of a question. Like, what is Mexico? Who is Madonna? What are chicken nuggets? The whole point of the game is to determine which contestant has the most knowledge on a wide variety of topics, while also being able to figure things out based on hints inside the clues. Yet, if the clue is, this rodent has a wide tail, makes dams, and likes to bite trees with its big teeth, and you say, it's a beaver! Alex Trebek will say, nope! And then someone else will ring in and say, what is a beaver? And Alex will say, you got it! Please remember your phrasing. What on earth does pretending to ask a question have to do with testing someone's knowledge? None. It has nothing to do with it. It is a very stupid, very arbitrary rule, which makes the game more difficult for no reason. Imagine if someone asked you, what is a shoehorn? And you said, this device allows you to put on and take off your shoes without touching the laces. Don't blow it. According to Jeopardy, that is a perfectly acceptable way to answer that question, even though no sane person would ever answer a question that way. I think Murph Griffin was smoking the reefer one day and thought, what if we had a trivia show, and instead of asking questions and having the contestants answer them, we answer the questions, and the contestants have to ask them. And then he made his pitch, and the network was like, that makes no sense, Murph. What the hell are you talking about? And then he said, excuse me, but which one of us is Merv Griffin? And the producer said, sorry, Mr. Griffin, we'll get right on that. And it became a huge success. And to this day, it still makes no sense. But we all go along with it because the alternative is to watch Wheel of Fortune, which is jeopardy for people who don't know what a shoehorn is or that a beaver is a rodent. They think it's like a marsupial or something or a chicken. By the way, I wrote this before Alex Trebek died. Yes, that was a long time ago. Yes, it was a long time before I recorded the video, after I wrote it. R.I.P. Alex Trebek, always in our hearts, forever our uh, inspiration. I don't know. Alex Trebek never inspired me to do anything, except get pissed off at a stupid rule in a game show where you have to ask a question? What is the point of that? That's my question. And don't forget, Alex Trebek is dead, but we all miss him.